What's the best way to thank Hashem for enabling us to survive? In Parshat B'Shalach, the Torah describes the miraculous redemption of the Israelites and having emerged on the other side of the Red Sea, they sang the famous Az Yashir, the Song of Moshe, in which they exclaimed, Zekeli ve'anvehu. This is my God and I will glorify him. That was their expression of gratitude to Hashem. But what does it actually mean? How do you glorify God? The Gemara in Masechet Shabbat of Kuf Lamed Gimel Amud Bet explains, I glorify Hashem by beautifying the commandments that I perform. It could be the tefillin I wear, or tzitzit, talit, the candles that I light just before Shabbat or Yom Tov, Arba Minim, and so on. We shouldn't treat these mitzvahs as opportunities to just pass the line, just kind of be yaitze, to do what is right and no more. Rather, we should take pride in them to show how much we appreciate the beauty of mitzvot, and in that way, we glorify Hashem's name. There is a different parish given by many of our medieval commentators, such as Unklos and Rashi Ibn Ezra and the Ramban. They say Ve'anvehu comes from the root Nave, which means a home. And therefore Ve'anvehu, they say, means I will build a home for Hashem. And here already, at the dawn of the existence of the Jewish nation, having emerged from Egypt, they aspired to build a temple, a home for Hashem. The parish that I like most is that of Rav Shimshon Rafael Hirsch. And he says that ve'anvehu literally means, I will become a home for Hashem. Indicating that the very essence of my being will be one through which I reflect the existence of the Almighty in the world. This I achieve through the spirituality that hopefully I will attain, and also the chesed, the loving kindness, that one can extend to others. When Avram Avinu stood before the children of Chet, wanting to purchase land to bury Sarah, they declared, Nesi Elokim Atabatocheinu, you are a prince of God in our midst. In Avram Avinu they saw somebody who embodied the very existence of Hashem through his ways. He was somebody who achieved the ve'anvehu. And they recognized a great person of Kedushah, of spirituality, and also a great master of chesed, somebody who genuinely cared for others. This is how we can thank Hashem for enabling our people to survive. This is how we can glorify Him through being veritable princes and princesses having Hashem in our hearts and minds all the time. Shabbat Shalom.